everyone welcome back we've got major news this morning aldi is said to be joining the formula one grid in 2026 so this is a teaser video from aldi and this is revealing what could be their car in the future what could be their formula one car in the near future this is a big deal I think most people would think that they'll be joining the Formula One grid maybe next year or in two years time, but this is what the car looks like. Absolutely fantastic. I love the livery. It looks super cool. But as it turns out, Aldi is gonna take the time to engineer a proper team, a proper Formula One team, a real Formula One team that can seriously compete with Mercedes, Red Bull, and with Ferrari, with the top guys in Formula 1, they want to compete, they want to win. And Aldi has a strong history of racing. I think they will fit the Formula 1 brand perfectly. It's been a really long time since a major car company joined Formula 1. It's been a really long time. I think the last time was Mercedes and that was what, 2010, 2009? I can't remember. Maybe even later, maybe it was 2010 or 11. But this is major. This is a huge deal. And for all the Formula 1 fans out there, I know you've got to be excited because I'm seriously excited. I mean, who doesn't like an Aldi car? They are fantastic. So it says here, the German manufacturer Aldi will join Formula 1 World Championship from 2026 season as a power supply unit. Now it comes after a few power unit regulations, design specifications make it possible and attracts for newcomers to join the sport and a competent level were established earlier this month. The 2026 power unit will remain a current V6 internal combustion engine, but features include electrical power and 100% sustainable fuel, two factors Aldi say they're key to join in. Aldi, who is part of the Volkswagen Group, added that it supports F1 teams plan to be more sustainable, cost efficient, with a cost cap for power unit manufacturing introduced in 2023, and F1 setting the target of being net zero by 2030. So Aldi announced its entry for 2026 at a press conference at Spa. Ahead of this weekend Belgium Grand Prix, which features chairman of board management of Aldi AG, Marcus Duschmann, member of the board of management for technical development, Oliver Hoffman, Domeni Kali and F1 president, Mohamed Ben Souli. The manufacturers said they will announce a decision on which team they will be lining up with in 2026 by the end of this year. That's awesome. All these sports facility in Newburgh will be where the power unit is developed, marking the first time in more than a decade that an F1 power unit will be built in Germany. Aldi says that there are already tested benches for F1 engine testing as well as electric motor, battery testing in Newburgh base. They're currently working on getting a personnel building and technical infrastructure in place by the end of the year. They will then have three years to fortune the PU before entering F1. So Aldi is planning to team up with another team. It looks like they will have their name on the car and it looks like they will be supplying the engine of the car. But it doesn't look like it will be a full Aldi team. It looks like it will be a part ownership. Kind of similar to McLaren Mercedes. Before Mercedes entered into F1 in early 2010-2011, they were partnered with McLaren. And this is the impression that I'm getting from everything. It it seems like Aldi will be joining as a partner, not a full team, but as a partner shared team, which is still a good thing, by the way. It's still super exciting. I am extremely excited to see Aldi join the F1 team. If they have their name on the car and they're building the engine, it's an Aldi team, in my opinion. So what do you think of the car? What do you think of these design? Are you excited for Aldi joining the F1 grid in 2026? I'm super excited. So this was just a quick video just to announce the huge news. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to see more. And of course, I will see you in our next news.